Hey everybody, Jeff Bates in my name. Dole Whip Dad is this channel. I am super glad you're here as I film this. It is 9 18 21, September 18th of 2021, as I film this. Why does that matter? It's this channel's anniversary. I didn't even know. I mean, I knew it was coming, but I didn't even know. I popped on this morning for my weekly live stream with my daughter. We talk Star Wars on this channel. And it was fun and it was a good time. But as I popped on, YouTube Studio said, hey, happy anniversary. I'm like, oh, that's cool. If you're a veteran of the channel, you know I've been hinting at sharing that, considering a channel pivot. I love Disney. When I first started this channel, it was Disney, food, family, sports. That's what I talked about. And I've kind of gotten away from that. Then I vlogged for a year. That All this stuff, right? I consider doing a live stream and making it a sports live stream. I've got this idea that I've been kind of milling for a while. And I'll be real with you. It starts tonight. It's me, it's you, and we talk about topics that are happening right now. It's going to be sports, it's going to be Disney, it's going to be cult pop culture, what's going on tonight. First episode, and I, I need your help. I, I'm either going to call it Breaking Bates, Bates is my last name, right? Breaking Bates, which is a podcast name that I have, that I haven't been using, that I like. So breaking Bates, but that's very me-centric. Also, Bates Ball Tonight, also me-centric. I think they're both too much me. I like the names. Baseball Tonight, Bates Ball Tonight. I feel like if I use Bates Ball Tonight, people would think it was going to be all sports. If I use Breaking Bates, I feel like mm, maybe pop culture's in there. Also, I think it's edgy and fun. I don't really care what the name is, but I'm going to invite you guys to come in and give me some ideas on that. Tonight, I've got an issue. I've got a rant. I'm ready to explode. Rolling Stones, 500 Greatest Songs of All Time, was just re-released. I think they did it in 04 and 2010. I wouldn't swear to that. But this is their third iteration of this. The 2021 list has been put out. And I have things to say. Number 10, Hey, yeah, by Outkast. Don't even like that song. Very catchy. Number nine, Fleetwood Mac's Dreams. Okay, I love me some Fleetwood Mac. That's not even my favorite song by them, but I love me some Fleetwood Mac. Number eight, Missy Elliott, Get Your Freak On. No, thank you. Number seven, The, Beatable, the Beatles, Strawberry Fields Forever. Beatles are overrated. I feel like it's like a hot thing to say right now, but it's true. They were great, but they're overrated. Strawberry Fields Forever, not even their best song. Number six, Marvin Gaye's What's Going On. Number five, Nirvana, Smells Like Teen Spirit, should be higher on those probably, but I'll take five. Bob Dylan's Like a Rolling Stone. I mean, I don't love Dylan, but okay. Number three, Sam Cooke's A Change Is Gonna Come. Number two, Public Enemies, Fight the Power. No. Number one, Aretha Franklin's Respect, R-E-S-P-E-C-T. I love that song. I don't think it should be number one, but it's a good, that, that's okay. I've got issues. I've got issues. I've got issues. Can you tell? <laughs> Join me tonight. What time are we doing the show? I should know it. I think it's, what time is it? 7 o'clock my time, 8 o'clock Eastern time, Saturday night, September 18th, 2021. I don't know what we're calling it. Breaking Bates. Bates Ball Tonight. 500 best songs of all time by Rolling Stone. I've got issues and we're going to talk about also. Channel anniversary party. Let's come hang out. Argue with me. Tell me why they're right. Why I'm wrong, why you're right, why I'm wrong. Whatever you want to say, come share it tonight. Top 500 songs of all time. Do you want a hint on what the greatest song of all time is? I'm never gonna dance again. Guilty feet have got... Warning, if you watch tonight's show, you're going to hear me sing. Not sorry. Sorry.